here. Why have we come to this odd corner of the town? It's Christmas here, too, you know. Uh, that's Bob Cratchit's house. Perhaps it was the spirit's own generous nature and his sympathy for all poor men that led them straight to the home of Scrooge's faithful clerk. <laughs> goose! They're cooking goose down there! <sighs> Lizzo, get out of the way. Hey, 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 don't be sweeping the chimney now. You're blocking the smell. This is Bob Cratchit's house. How do you know that? You just told me. Hmm. Well, I'm usually trustworthy. <laughs> Who's that? Mrs. Cratchit, of course. <sighs> Peter, do not stop turning that spit. That is the whole secret of a properly roasted goose. It smells so good, Mother. It does, doesn't it? Oh, that smells wonderful. Oh. oh, good grief. Hey, I'm stuck. Get me out of here. I knew you weren't suited for literature. <laughs> oh, at least I landed on something soft. And hot! Oh, 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 hot! Ah, oh, hot, 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 hot! Mother, mother, mother! I thought you said we couldn't eat the chestnuts until Father and Tiny Tim get home. I wasn't uh, eating them. I was, uh, I was merely checking them to see if they were not burnt. It's a chef's thing, dear. And do not shout, Bettina. I'm Belinda. I'm Bettina. Uh, uh, of course you are, uh, Bettina. Belinda. Whatever. 